Welcome back guys, it's Cosmo and this is Will We Make It. You know we cover everything in this channel from creating, trading, and gaming. And today we're going to be talking about gaming. If you are looking to create your gaming channel or record gaming videos or streaming, anything of that nature, you're going to need a good capture card. Well, today we're going to be looking at a really good one, the Asus tough gaming capture box we're gonna open it up set it up see how it works and see how easy it is to set up and see what you guys think all right so let's get started So the Tough Gaming Capture Box offers fanless cooling technology built with an aluminum body for robust but light structure and efficient cooling. Create an extremely calm live broadcasting space for you. It offers uncompressed 4K video capture, ultra low latency. It captures video without compression and transmits raw data via faster USB 3.2. Experience immersive and amazing gameplay. Once you've got it all hooked up, you just simply load up your OBS, go to add a device, you want to add a video capture device, and from the drop down menu, you should see the CU4K30 option. Once you put that on, once you select that, it should pop right up. So some of you may have seen this HDCP error. Um, I got it when I set it up. I did run into some difficulties and to be honest with you, I couldn't find any reason why I was kept getting these errors. I assumed it was the cables. I swapped the cables out. Um, I tried everything. So I had to do some more digging. Upon doing some more digging, I realized it was probably my PlayStation. And uh, sure enough, I researched it and looked online that the PlayStation 4, by default, has the HDCP enabled. And you can simply go into your settings and turn it off. As I have here displayed here, turn off HDCP on PlayStation 4. Um, you simply go into your settings and you go into your systems and it will say HDM enable, uh, HDCP enabled and just uncheck the box. Um, certain programs won't work with it. Obviously any streaming platforms like Netflix, uh, Amazon Prime, HBO Max, different things like that won't work with it. So, you know, just had to do a little digging and finally got that figured out. So it did take a little bit of, uh, frustration at one point but I figured it out and here's the final result. So all in all not bad uh, you know I, if you didn't have a PlayStation 4 to hook up it'd be a, probably be a lot easier. So I'll leave a link down below for the Tough uh, Gaming Box. It's excellent. I'll be using it to stream my games. So check it out. You'll get a discount if you click on my link and purchase it uh, from down in the description. Y'all take care and I'll see you next time.